We are continuing our coverage on the current closure of a popular bridge that connects Illinois and Indiana. The Lincoln Memorial Bridge of Vincennes closed about a month ago to remove decaying stones on the 90-year-old bridge. Will Price talked to the chief ranger at George Rogers Clark Park to get an update on how work is going. Will? The long overdue project is now underway and nearing its halfway point. Right now, it's so far so good, but they have made new discoveries since work started back in January. It's hard to miss near the Lincoln Memorial Bridge in Vincennes. Piles of brick after brick lay as the National Park Service continues renovation work on the structure. Chief Ranger at George Rogers Clark Park, Joe Heron, says they haven't met any roadblocks on the project so far but some of the decay has been worse than expected. Not huge surprises, but we are finding areas where the brick are much more deteriorated underneath the stones. Uh, there is going to be a massive rebuild, and the engineers are going to kind of retool everything as it goes back on. They already have one of the large stone pillars removed. A brick falling off of one of the pillars was the safety concern that helped officials finally get to work on the project after years of delays. Heron says overall, everything is on time and on target through about a third of the process. Uh, the timeline's looking really good on the bridge project. We are a little over a third of the removal of the stones. The stones are being stored adjacent to the park. After that, the bridge should reopen in late April, but that will be the first step. Heron says the end goal is to replace the pillars, making it so the bridge looks the way it was originally intended but much safer. The deconstruction, the removal of the stones will be through late April. Uh, we're looking at the return of the stones in probably another year. 